Hello, it's John Burford with Chart of the Week for Monday the, the uh, 13th of January and today I want to cover Fresnillo, the FTSE 100 silver miner which I've been covering on and off for quite some time. My latest uh, coverage was in September but before we discuss the, sh the shares um, it's always a good idea to have a look at what the precious metals are doing themselves not just silver but gold now gold and is the major uh, metal in the uh, in the pair and uh, this is the chart going back to um, late 2018 now the B I've, I've labeled the B wave down here at the 1050 level and from that point it's risen in three waves his waves one, uh, sorry in five waves is one is two is long and strong wave three a shallow wave four and a final thrust into wave five to a new high took it to the Fibonacci 62 percent retrace of the decline of the all-time high at one thousand nine hundred and twenty dollars and uh, that is usually a good spot to um, to dis to uh, detect any reversal in the trend so with five waves up and uh, uh, to the 52 uh, to the 62 percent level then I'm labeling that the end of end of my C wave and I'm looking for a very sharp move down and silver I believe <clears throat> I believe will probably accompany it uh, probably qu not quite as sharply but certainly uh, the downtrend I believe has started all right here's the um, here's the silver chart it's it shows roughly the same shape wave one wave two uh, wave three long and strong is it wave three I'm not sure and his could be a possible wave four now that would be confirmed on a move to a new high and look it didn't make a new high S gold did last week silver did not that's a massive divergence and if this is indeed the high for the silver market I think that spells curtains for the bull market in both uh, gold silver and of course Fresnillo so let's go to the Fresnillo chart okay let's go back to here this was the equivalent buying place for silver metal and sure enough the shares followed hit the major downtrend wedge line on a small, small momentum divergence uh, that was a bit of a giveaway then a collapse uh, rally in three waves up to the September 5th of September high that's exactly when my chart of the week was published I advised uh, taking profits in Fresnillo and also if you are so inclined to short it and we've had some st stair step fashion uh, bear trend down here we've had another buy silver uh, signal here and the and the shares did rally but pretty weak rally up to oops up to the yellow uh, downtrend line and it's bounced off it and the latest is 624 we sold at 750 so the shares are well down from from our selling point um, now my view is that the um, next target is here and about the the um, the five pound area now I'm not sure what will happen after that it could bounce or it could continue lower and uh, that would be a very bearish signal if it did so so unless uh, the shares can rally above this point here 750 and push above this solid downtrend line if they can do that then my forecast able but as of now I am bearish on Fresnillo